It's big. It's great. It's, it's, oh look, secret passage. It's the Texas Renaissance Festival here in just north of Houston, Texas. The largest such festival of Renaissance in the entire country, possibly the entire world. And uh, that is where I am today. Not for any particular reason other than I have family in town and they like this place, my dad likes this place, and you know, to be fair, I like this place pretty well as well. Now, I've been here probably eight, nine times in my life because in Houston, we don't really have any other sort of theme parks to have any sort. No Six Flags, no Disney, obviously, no SeaWorld, any of that type of stuff. So, this is the closest thing we have. And now, however, this place is only open about eight weeks out of a year, basically from like mid-October through the end of November, usually. So even this isn't like a full year-round amusement park. This is one of the few places in the world where you can dress up like this and you're heralded as a hero. Now I'm not just filming this video to be like the next big greatest vlogger in the world. It's more because I haven't made a video in like over a week and I don't have any other videos planned until around Christmas time. So I uh, figured I needed to put something up and I thought what interesting things do I have at my disposal? This is the first thing that came to mind. Oh yes, the medieval instrument of choice. The loot. You're right, my bad, that's the electric loot. Gotta plug that into like a dragon or something to make noise. I think I found my calling. Oh, that was just a little wide, right? Very sharp. So close. Oh, I thought that was it, dang. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That is. I have a funny turkey like story about up from Disney World on my channel. So this is just like this it's is like, a rough one. This is triggering me right now. <laughs> the main thing this place does well is it gives a, it has a lot of cool shops with things you know you aren't gonna see at Target, and uh, it's got food like you saw at Big Turkey Legs, a lot of fried stuff because it's Texas. But they also have shows, and some of the shows never change. They're literally the same show for the last decade, but that doesn't mean they're not as funny as they they've always been. They also have a few rides here, or like little games and stuff. I'll show you some of those later. Y'all saw me trying to use, how dare you. You also saw me trying to shoot an arrow. I'm not very good at that, but it is what it is. So many people, my lord. Look at this popcorn guy, holy crap. And here it is, arguably the greatest part of this entire festival thing. The King's Maze is basically just a giant little maze that you can walk through. Uh, I do this every time I get here. Me and my friends do it. One year we did it and got lost in there for about 45 minutes. That was not our most shining moment. We had people trying to show us the way out. They're like, we've been through it. Like, we can help you. And we're like, no, we've got to do it ourselves. Uh, every time I've done it since then, though, I've gotten out in about five minutes or less. So, see how, it do, how we do this year. We're in. You know, years ago when I've done this, in the years past when I've done this, I haven't been nearly as tall, so I couldn't really see over this, but I almost can now. Right, you lead the way, Clara. I'll follow you. Follow me. I will follow you. I'll stay right on you at all times. I'm still, I'm right, I'm right behind you. And dead end. What a nice, what a nice turn of events. That's where we're trying to get to, the center of the maze, to ring the bell, so we're not really that close. I'm following Reagan, even though I think we already went this way. Like, we went that way. I see what you're saying. Let's go, yeah, go straight. Yeah, this must be a marker. The natives must have used this as a marker, so I think we're on the right path. And that's another dead end. I'll just go kill myself. I have an idea. I'm six foot seven. I'll just videotape Let's see, and there's another dead end. Why am I not surprised? So long in this space. I've lost the others. It's been, it's been hours at least. I don't, I don't, I haven't made any progress. <laughs> I can't. This, I thought this was for kids. Still more walking. I can't. It's taunting me. Oh, no. Finally. Finally. It's a Christmas miracle. 
Oh. How did we ever make our way out of this such a thing? Wow, it is crowded. Let's play a quick game of Where's Waldo. Find the kid in the black and orange striped shirt. All right, anybody, have you found him yet? I'm giving you, okay. All right, there it's time's up, there he is. If you're blind, you're blind. If you couldn't find him, you couldn't find him, but there he is. It's trolling me. Yeah, I need to sharpen him, that's what it is. I just need to sharpen him a little bit more. Let's see. All right, I think it'll work, I think it'll work. I hit the star. I would've killed my opponent, that's all that matters. That I'd like to see you do any better. <laughs> Haunted house. Uh, apparently they have movie props from a lot of classic and even fairly recent horror movies, but it's pretty dark. <laughs> oh, and there's a lot of loud noises every now and then, so it's kind of kind of creepy. I don't know how well you can see this on video. Oh, jeez! It's very loud. Just gonna mosey on through here and look at that creepy thing. It's supposed to be Christmas time, not Mortal Kombat time, whatever that's from. Oh, okay, well that's just nice pretty lights and looks like a bad kid's science project, I don't know. Yeah, this is kind of cool actually, I don't remember all these lights. Okay, this looks horrifying. Jeez! Why would you spray air at me? That's not even like, it's not even cool, it's just spraying air at me. Ooh, you guys got brains. <laughs> Alright, so... What is that? Is I've seen. Yeah, I was gonna say that's this is from Bioshock Infinite, isn't it? I like this game, so this is cool. What are they called again? The, those are huge dudes. I forgot. Does it say it? I think it says it on the thing. Big dudes. Ah well, those of you who've played Bioshock Infinite, let me know. I mean, I played it. I just don't remember. I'm, I didn't pay that close of attention. Oh jeez! It was so loud. Oh, made it. That was pretty neat. What did you think? Think it was neat. Did you think it was neat, Reagan? I thought it was pretty cool. Swords. Certainly. Oh, very, very dull tip. Could just really bruise somebody with that. These magic wands are really cool, though. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, look at this. Look at this. Alakazam. Just choose your spirit animal. And that will be your walking stick. Dragon. <laughs> it for the Texas Renaissance Festival. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you're not already. Other videos, some NASCAR, some not. Hopefully a lot of random stuff coming out in the next few weeks until I have time to make things you want to see. So hope you enjoyed this. Uh, catch you later.